Hi everyone, it's uh, Sunday the 3rd of August 2014 and um, some of you may know I've put up a Serio SD27 dipole recently, one of those. Well, what you can do on a weekend is if you had to have two of those SD27s, you could turn them into a two element beam. Which is what I've done today. I did have a bit of trouble with the SWR, but that's my own fault for cutting the elements too short. And uh, the blessed thing resonating around 30 megs. Anyway, got around that, extended them out again, and um, managed to um, get the right tool to uh, remove the uh, uh, the um, driven element. Uh, dipole holder if you want to call it that on the spare SD27 took me a while to work out how to get it off and put it onto the uh, the boom you can see there so that's the original SD27 and then at the back because it's quite a long boom it's about 1.3 meter boom something like that I managed to put the dipole center from my spare SD27 onto there a the special tool and uh, it's on and then just put the elements from the second dipole onto there and um, it works <laughs> once I sort the SWR out it works, I just worked Brazil on it its um, station was about 6 S points from Brazil and when I turned it in the opposite direction he went down to 1 S point turned it back round he went up to 5 or 6 S points again so I know I've got directivity there and I'm not just guessing it was uh, a fluke so it's all working. Um, ideally, it would be better to get the SY3 or the SY4 with the uh, third element, but I just happened to uh, pick a couple of uh, SD27s up off of uh, radio rallies and uh, turned them into two element beams, but I do for now. So there you go, messing about doing aerials all weekend, but uh, having fun. 7-3, thanks for looking. We'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.